Yesterday, Garmin released a new firmware version 8.0 for the Phoenix 5 family, the 935 and the Kronos. There are three new features I wanted to show you in this video. First up, there are two new widgets, the sunrise and sunset widgets and an alternate time zone widget. To install, go to settings, widgets, go all the way down until you reach add widget. By scrolling down here, we should see both the sunrise and sunset widget and the alternate time zone widget. To install, just press top right button. It will say widget added and do this for both of them. If we then go back to our main screen, we can go up and we will now see the alternate time zone widget and the sunrise and sunset widget. I think this is a nice display based on your current GPS position, showing you also the twilight times. And by pressing the top right button here, we can scroll up or down to select a different date and see how it changes over time. So let's leave it at 17th of February. So let's have a look at the alternate time zone widget. To start, press the top right button to add the time zone. So let's go ahead and select uh, US Alaska time. We don't want to rename that zone, so leave that as it is. And we can select two more here. Let's do US Eastern. We don't want to rename. And the final one, let's do Western European. So there we go. If we push back now, we have the three different time zones and notice the small red arrow showing your current time in your current position, regardless of the time zones you have selected. And then the three other time zones are shown with their own small arrow here. Finally, they've added a setting to display a calibration prompt when using a power meter. So to check that out, go to settings, then go to sensors and accessories. Here, go and select your power meter. So inside that menu, you will see a separate menu for calibration prompt disabled. Or to enable that, press the top right button. These updates should automatically be installed on your watch. If it doesn't, make sure you have automatic updates enabled. To check that out, go to settings, system, and all the way down to software update. It should say on. So that's all for now. All the best and see you next time.